You guys ready for this? Good to go, Jared? All right. Well, thanks for coming out, everybody. I know this is a really exhilarating amount of people. Um, next year, <laughs> next year it'll be 300 people here, um, at least. So be ready for that. But um, no, I wanted to do this. This is a really big thing I wanted to do because I know right now what we got two, four, six, eight, got ten people in here. But what we accomplished this year, really, like both COD and league for esports, was uh, I think pretty phenomenal. I mean, we grew really fast. Uh, we got the eyes of the administration on us. We got I don't know, there's people looking and they're interested now. And I think next year will be like 10 times better. But because of that, I wanted to give back to everybody because you guys have been here the whole, you know, the whole uh, year giving your all. So uh, we're going to first start with the League of Legends team and they're going to give out, I think, one of their awards right now because the rest of the people aren't here. But um, Esther, if you'd like to come up, please. <laughs> All right, Hong, come up. Took a really long time, guys. Just bear with me for a moment. So that was the conclusion of the league awards. If you didn't catch on that, um, I wish I wish the rest of them were able to make it, but uh, we keep moving. But now we're going to move to the COD awards, and there's a lot of them. Um, and I guess I'll give a little sermon on uh, the COD team. I remember I thought about this idea back in I think about a year ago, like now, and I was like watching teams like RIT and Concord Maroon play all this stuff, and I was like, that is so sweet, man. I've been playing that game since I was in third grade, and to be able to go on a collegiate level and play for your school, um, I thought that was pretty cool. And then it was also pretty validated considering there was a sizable scholarship fund to it, but the real, the real fun with, with it was uh, just being able to play, build it, and now it's going to continue on after me, and you guys are going to do that. so. Um, first, I'm going to have you guys come up here. I got, a, got something for all of you. I had it alphabetized and I had my computer ready to go, but we're going to just wing it now. So first, promise, if you'd like to come up here. Thanks for being a part of the team, man. Hope to see you out there. Next, uh, next year, I'm going to start a team or something. Sound good? I, I shake your hand with COVID. So. Oh, I can't. We can't do that. Um, I'm just playing it safe. Huh? I get uh, okay. I'm clean. I'm good. But all right. Thank you, Ryan. All right. Here. Here. I'll do this. You said give him a kiss? Yeah. There you go. Thank you, Connor. Thank you, Prom. Thank you. I almost just called Prom Connor. That would have been really bad. Just 
Mr. Doug Respectable Roser. Can you come up here, please? Thanks, man, for being a part of the team and being the most absolutely crack fogger ever. I got, I got it. You never know. You, you know, the school might be watching this, so you never know. And then they, they just been the esports club. Jake, Diven, Colin, can you come up here, please? Thanks for being a submarine or a scuba guy. I don't know what scuba that, That's what it means, right? Uh, scuba diving, yeah. Okay, awesome. Awesome. All right, man. Thank you. Jared, could you please come here? Thank you for being a part of the team this year as well and uh, handling a lot of the administrative stuff, you know. I, I did a lot of that stuff, but then you alleviated some of it, so thank you. Appreciate no it. No problem. Thank you. Connor, could you please come up here? Skilled. Um, Brandon, you better watch out because you're just you're almost you're, you're just about there with that. Okay, thank you. I guarantee people are watching. Like, what is he doing with his elbow? I can uh, Polish Prince, please come up here. Shout out the rest of everybody here. I don't have James and Johnny, but thank you to Johnny, Raj, Mike, James, and Justin. Uh, I know you guys weren't able to make it. I don't. I think Mike's watching the stream. Uh, Mike, I'm better than you at Call of Duty. Um, but no, seriously, thank you all of you guys for being a part of the team. Um, I did not think that we would have as many people as we did. Um, I remember when I first started it, I was like running around throwing those posters up. Uh, and I was like, maybe I, maybe I can get three guys. Maybe I can get four. Maybe we can have one starting team. But no, it got, got way bigger than that. So I can't ask for better. But now we're going to move uh, forth with the physical awards. And I got to pull up my handy dandy script here because I'm really not that great of a public speaker. So. So there's a. There's plenty of awards here, um, but first, the first one that we got is uh, this one's the best hard point player. Uh, this is the person that best displays their skill in the game in the hard point game mode, and just clutches up in general. And uh, the recipient of that is uh, Brandon Kowalski. Thank you, sir. <laughs> so the next award we have is uh, in similar fashion, but this is for the best control player, the person who best displays their skill in the control game mode. Um, and the winner of this award is uh, Connor Pete. Keep doing it, man. Capital A and B. Not sure if you guys can guess what's next, but this next award is the best search and destroy player, um, and that is none other than uh, Mr. Jake Holland. Get 
the bomb play. My job in search is just dying. So now we, th those are the general awards for the game modes. Um, now they're going to get a little more specific and, and uh, different. But So this next award is uh, it's called the Pioneer of the Year Award. Uh, this is for a player that has demonstrated their dedication to the team in non-traditional means. Um, uh, helps push the team's entire efforts forward through all ways other than playing the game. And the recipient of this is Jared Best. Thank you, my man. Appreciate it. Sheesh! I know I can't make up my mind. I'm like, do I, do I shake their hand? Do I? I don't know, man. But it's all right. We're all uh, good to go. Um, this next award is called the Playmaker of the Year Award. Uh, this is uh, the player that best exemplifies that could turn the tide in any moment in the game um, in high pressure situations and make great plays. And the recipient of this reward is uh, Brandon Kowalski. I think you'll like this one. Don't know why. Not for anything. I love cereal, but egg toast. Yes, you guys. So this uh, next award is the Rookie of the Year Award. Uh, this award was only uh, only um, eligible to freshmen and sophomores, um, and it kind of explains itself. But this is the underclassman player who has best displayed that they are a promising and skilled asset to the team, and the recipient of this is Connor Pete. This next award is uh, the Most Improved Player Award. Um, this also speaks for itself, but this is uh, for a player sh who has shown the most improvement over the year, and this recipient is Jake Holland. This one's pretty neat, too. This is your, this is your new stuff. Ooh, new controller. <laughs> yeah. yeah, break it and throw it in rice again. Uh, this next award, oh, also, I don't know if I started off with this, but all of you know, but for those of you, those of you that are watching, all these awards were voted on by the players. Um, so this was not this determined by me, but rather the players. Um, this next award is the Lone Wolf of the Year Award. This is uh, similar to the Playmaker Award, except that this player uh, can shown, has shown they can be the last man standing in a situation and clutch up the game to turn the tide. Uh, and the recipient of this is Brandon Kowalski. <laughs> exactly what I was thinking, dude. Thank you, yeah. It's a breather, man. You can walk out here. <laughs> this award, I feel like, is probably the most sought after one, but this one is the Crack Pogger of the Year Award. I'm not explaining it. Um, but this is the most, uh, this is the award for the most absolutely crack pogger individual that has graced the team this year. And this is none other than Douglas Roser. <laughs> the man himself. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Uh, so this leaves us with the, we have 10 awards in total, physical at least, and this leaves us at the last one, and this is the Most Valuable Player Award. Um, this player is regarded as the best, uh, the best player on the team and the most important asset, and time and time again has proven so. And uh, the recipient of this is Brandon Kowalski. Stay up here. <laughs> oh, okay. This one is the League Captain's Choice Award, and this is one that you guys didn't know about. And this is actually, as long as Call of Duty keeps going, and uh, in the same fashion as it does, I'd like to, uh, I'd like to make that an ongoing tradition. Uh, league Captain will pick a person of their choosing at the end of their, uh, 
end up being the league captain or such for every year. But this is just a person that um, I regard as the biggest help to me uh, in building this. And he's standing up here, so it's not as much of a surprise <laughs> anymore. But yeah, that is none other than uh, Grant Kowalski. I'm just going to go over here because I know you're going to stay up here. <laughs> Again, thank you everybody for all the awards, for real. Um, I couldn't have done it without any of you guys, for real. Especially Ryan. Um, I mean, just to say a couple things about Ryan, the guy who started it all. I just came to Utica College. I mean, like most of us, played some video games here and there. Never thought of it, you know, too competitively. And then... Ryan had an idea. Jared came to me. He goes, hey, there's an eSports club. And I go, yeah, sure, you know, might as well. Got some free time. And then here we are today. We're handing out awards. Um, played in the league for 25K, you know, for scholarship money. Um, 180 plus teams, 150 colleges. It's kind of insane to me how we're, you know, here now and growing. And that all started because of Ryan. And I really can't thank you guys or Ryan, really anybody enough, you know. Kind of, uh, it gave me, like, you know, not, not even just something to do, you know, it's more than that now, after, you know, everything we've been through together. So, I appreciate that, boys. Thank you. Thank you. So, with that being said, that was very nice of you, uh, Brandon, thank you. I said that was very nice of you, thank you. Um, but yeah, I mean, with that, uh, he's got so many awards, he's forgetting them. <laughs> With that being said, I mean, that's, uh, that's pretty much the conclusion of this. Um, we're supposed to have a video playing on in the background, uh, more people here, but that's okay. We're, we're going to do with what we have. But for, for our 10,000 viewers watching right now, or 100,000, thank you for coming out. I appreciate it. Um, but yeah, that is the end of the award ceremony. And er, thank you, everybody. Like, uh, appreciate it.